hello 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 and welcome to my channel right now i only have one person on so go ahead when you come in just go ahead and um say your name where you're from and i can shout you out but right now i'm gonna go ahead and put this in my group this um link in my group so everybody know that i am here welcome 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 i need to get a mouse on my computer y'all Excuse me, my son in the background screaming at the dog like he's somebody daddy. Hey, Embroidery Diva. Hey, Cass Casey. Hey, Sandra. Hey, Lawanda. Son. Shane. Close the door, please. Close the door. Shane. Close the door, please. Hey, y'all. Y'all coming up in here. Hey, Shayna. Hey, Suzette. Hey, Finding Joy. Hey, I like that name. Finding Joy. Cause I need to find my joy. Hey, um, Loretta, Demetra. So you turn this on real quick. How's everybody doing? I'm trying to stay uh, regular, y'all. I was here last week, and I'm here this week. I'm doing good, y'all. So let me get on here. <sighs> hey, Sherry. Hey, Great Grace Cherry. Hey, Shanita. Hey, San Doris. Hey, Sherry. From um, Mola, Mobile, Alabama. I can tongue twisted already, and I just started, y'all. Y'all pray for me. Y'all watching one of my videos earlier. I was doing a 101 today. So shout out to everybody that's been uh, booking me for their 101s. I do 101s for um sublimation, sewing, cricket, silhouette, canva, embroidery. So whatever you want to do, whatever you want to learn, I can do a 101 with either Zoom or face to face. And I had this lady come in today and, I, um, and did a 101 face to face. And, I, and she was looking for a video and I was one of my old videos and she was trying to do something. And I looked at my videos, and I'm like, and I was like, oh, my God, I talk so fast. Oh, Lord, it's so embarrassing. Y'all got to tell me to slow down. <laughs> I was like, Lord, I hate that I talk so fast. Y'all, I believe me, if I could help it, I, I would. But I be getting so excited, and I just be talking off my face. I was like, Lord, I sound horrible. Y'all need to tell me. <laughs> Did you ever get around to checking your messages? Hey, Creation, I don't, I check my messages. I must, I got to check it again. She said, I talk fast too. I sound horrible, y'all. You had to tell me to slow down. I hate the way I talk. But yeah, I looked at that video. I don't know what video it was. And I was, what, what video was that? <sighs> oh, 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 because she wanted to see how I um <laughs> embroidered the, I mean, how she, how I um did the uh, sublimation in the uh, sublimating uh, tumbler in my Cricut mug press. Right, so I got a video to show you how to sublimate a tumbler in a Cricut mug press, and I had to go back and I'm trying to, you know, get the link so I can send it to her. I was like, Lord Jesus, that girl just be talking, talking, talking. Hey y'all, hey. So let me go ahead and put this in my group. Um. So today we are going to be sublimating some T-shirts live. It's Halloween coming up, so my son loves ugly, crazy, scary shirts. So I'm going to be sublimating two shirts for him. And also, y'all, I'm going to Jamaica. She said, okay, slow down. <laughs> I'm talking fast already? <laughs> Mamie? Is that her name, Mamie? Um, so I'm going to Jamaica next week, y'all. I can't wait. Hey, hey, hey. Get my groove back. Um, so I'm making some sublimation masks for everybody that's going. It's going to be a girl's trip. A couple people having their birthday or whatever. So I'm doing some masks today too, but I'll probably do the mask after this video, but it depends on how long it takes me to do these. Hey, so, so create creative. Thank you for the 499 super chat. I appreciate it. Ching, ching. Thank you. Um, let me see if she said anything. Nope. She didn't say anything. So thank you so much for the super chat. I appreciate you. Um, my nose is running, y'all. I hope I ain't getting sick, y'all. I can't be getting sick. I'm about to go to Jamaica, y'all. My nose is running, so please believe, forgive me if I got if I'm sniffing. I gotta get some tissue and blow my nose. I'm gonna do that in a minute because I can't stand somebody just be sniffing for no reason. Just be sniffing. So let me go blow my nose real quick and wash my hands, and I'll be back. I don't want y'all to be like, girl, do something with that nose of yours. But yeah, um, go ahead and um 
Charlene from Chattanooga, Tennessee. Hello, hello. If you're if you're um newbie, go ahead and say newbie. I'll right back. Okay, I'm sorry, y'all. Okay, I'm back. Hey, hey, thumbs up this video. Hey, hey, um, Kate, uh, Kate I don't know what's her name. Miss Die. Help. Welcome, newbie. We do say virgins for newbies. Some people don't say it like they don't like to say they virgins. You know, you might not be one, but you virgin. You a virgin over here with us. So um, usually I say virgin. People be getting offensive. Like I'm sorry, I'm sorry. So if you want to say virgin, if you want to say newbie, we just having fun. Shout out to all my newbies and virgins here on our channel, Shaniqua, um, Rosetta, um, Shanetta, uh, Shirlene, Shirlene, uh, Four Corners Custom Products Mobile, um. I don't know how to say her name. Cayenne. Is that how you say it? Cayenne? That's how it's spelled. Cayenne? So welcome all the newbies. Tanisha. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Um, go ahead and like this video and go ahead and subscribe to this channel because I'm on here all the time. I do um, videos, a lot of lives because I don't have to worry about editing the video. You can look at me do the things I do right in front of your face. And if I mess up, you'll be like, okay, girl, I won't mess up like you did. <laughs> So yeah, I mess up, I do whatever, I talk fast, so that's my disclaimer, so excuse me. And I do embroidery, I do cricket, I do sublimation, I do sewing, I do everything except for bling bling shirts and epoxy. Maybe everything. I don't do a lot of paper crafts, but I do have some paper crafts on my videos that I've done before. But now I've just been doing a lot of clothing, a lot of different things, but I don't do a lot of paper crafting. But I will be doing, like I said, if you ever need, if anyone needs some um one on one, either by Zoom or you can come meet me face to face or FaceTime or whatever, I can do. I'm doing I'm talking fast. Slow down, Charmaine. I'm doing one on ones, and they are basically you get four classes, and all of the classes are two two hours each, and I'm doing it on sublimation, and each section session has to be one. You only can pick one for the four classes, which is two hours. So you can pick one. If you want to take another class, you can pick one. So they are paid classes. If you want to do a class, inbox me on Facebook, Charmaine Galloway, and I can contact you and give more information. But let me tell you what they are, what you can um take a class on. Sublimation, embroidery, beginning sewing, cricket, Canva, and if you might know what Canva is, it's basically a software you can use to design a lot of things. And I'm going to start doing more videos on Canva because Canva is sweet, okay? Um, Canva, free, sewing, cricket, silhouette. Also a designer program you can get for free. I can teach you how to design on that. What am I missing, y'all? Sublimation, embroidery, okay? So I do all those. I mean, whatever you want. If you want to do something I didn't name, <laughs> contact me and we can do a one-on-one. -on -one. Some people say they can't learn from doing live videos. So I can help you step by step and we can go through everything. We got two hours a day to do it for four days. So you like my shirt, y'all? I dreamt it. I worked hard. I grind till I own it. Hey, hey, hey. Okay. If y'all know me, I'm Charmaine Galloway. I'm from Ohio. Uh, I have a boutique called Charming Girl Boutique. I have a boutique called um, Array of Sunshine Boutique. That's my children's boutique. I make tutus. I make embroidery shirts for young kids. You know, my adult. Charming, on my Charming Gal Boutique, I make everything from clothes, from... Check me out on you, Etsy. If you see things... <laughs> what's up, Dimps? Dimps got me going. She got my children. She got all the links. If you see Dimps, Dimps, I mean, Dimps Designs, you can check, check her links out that she's putting up now, but I will be putting them in the description bar right now so you can have it. So I won't forget. So let me do that now, too. Um, But yeah, I got a lot going on. And I love what I do. And I love teaching people new things. So people be like, girl, you you so real. You tell us everything. Yes, I don't mind telling us or nobody. I don't mind telling what I know because we can all get it. I'm sorry. Mom, I'm getting, I hope I ain't get sick, y'all. Please pray for me. I can't get sick. I'm going to, I'm going to Jamaica. And, and I got to have a clean COVID test on Monday when I take it. So y'all pray for me. Um, I said clean. I told y'all your girl be making up your girl be making up words just be, just out the blue like a clean COVID test. And so, let me see. Uh, <laughs> I suppose I make I make myself laugh. Um, 
I have to have a negative COVID test. Okay, how about that? Hey, newbie. Hey. Hey, best unit crew. I don't see you on there, but I just see them say hello to you. So I guess you're here. Shout out to them. She be welcome, welcoming everyone and she be on it. Thank you, girl. Um, Dim's Designs. Check her out. What's your, um, what's your, um, site, Dim's? Are you uh, on the website or on your Etsy? Copy. Let me put this in here, y'all. I'm putting the links under my video right now. Let me see. Alexandra, did you make the shirt? Yes, I did. I, this is an old shirt. I made this a couple years ago. Hey, do you have courses for t-shirts and embroidery? Yes, I said I do have embroidery shirts. Yeah, I mean embroidery um yes, classes. I, I sure do. Anything embroidery, I can teach you. One on one classes, just inbox me. Did you get your Is it you, Lanise? Lanise Hard, did you send me the earrings? Because girl, I was about to forget, but no, I didn't forget because they're right here. I was gonna show everybody. So it's Lanise, are you the one who sent me the earrings? Cause she looks, she like, did you send, did you get them earrings? Yeah, hey girl, hey girl. Lanise Hall, she is the bomb, y'all. I, mean, I hope I'm saying your name right. I didn't even know that was you. But hey girl, hey, yes, I got your earrings and I'm about to show y'all in a minute. This is a sublimation video, so I am going to be sublimating shirts, but I do have some sublimation blanks that my girl, Lu Lanise, sent to me. She sent me some stuff, y'all, and she is the bomb.com. Check her out at, girl, I got them right here, believe me. I won't, I will, maybe I would have forgot. And did it at the end of the video, but girl, one crafty chick, okay? Run crafty chick on Etsy. And I think she got a website too. Check her out. I'm gonna show y'all what she sent me. Girl, y'all know I'll be happy when I be getting this mail. Today is Wednesday, so this is happy mail too. So I'm gonna show y'all my little happy mail I got today. Um, last week I got some mugs and somebody sent me some mugs and they was beautiful. Check out that um last video. I so made on these beautiful, beautiful mugs. I'm gonna show y'all that again because she said that y'all was blowing her up. So shout out to y'all that supported these businesses. These cups are the bomb though. So y'all better get them before they sell out because they've been people on my channel been she told me people have been calling her and calling her for these mugs. So anybody that has some stuff that y'all want to send to me that y'all want to um have me show. And um, and even I can even hmm, I can even sh embroider like I said on her mugs. I I'm supposed to say embroidery. I can even sublimate on the things or whatever y'all give me. I can show it off, shout you out, inbox me, and I can give you my my address. What am I doing? I can't do two things at once. My brain be everywhere. Cancel. Okay, save it. So yes, I'm gonna show. I'm gonna show these earrings. The um crafty chick. Her name is the shop is called. One Crafty Chick LLC. Check her out on Etsy. And um, she probably have a, a website too. So check her out. She sent me some stuff today. And I'm going to show y'all what she sent me. Some earrings. And I already showed y'all before. Some videos I had before that I've yeah, sublimated her earrings already. already. I already showed y'all before. Some videos I had before that I... Sorry, I hate to talk. Um, So check out these videos. It's probably called sublimation, Sublimating Earrings. Okay? I'm making all these faces, y'all. Tell me to stop. I'm looking at myself. Um, so let's get started. I'm just going ahead and put this. I already did it. Oh, I did it already. So all the links y'all will need is under this video, and everything I've used in this video is is under this video. So if y'all can, if, if y'all do, slow down, your man. I'm not talking to myself, but I am. If y'all do, click on any of my links below this video. I will get a certain percentage of that if you click on my SC. If you click on my Amazon links, I will get a certain percentage off of that. And also, check out these links. They're on here right now. Check out these links. I have one called um, Sublimation Discount Blanks. Um, they have discounted blanks on there. Check that out. Also, check out Designs by Amara. She has some nice, nice um, link images. Everybody's going to ask me where I get my images from. Check her link out. She has a lot of nice images, and you will get a discount on those, okay? And I also have... I'm, I'm affiliated with her. Um, check out... Okay, I always say this wrong. Mujuka, M-U-J-K-A. She has a lot of nice images too. So the, the links are below this video. Just click on them and you will get a discounted price, okay, on your images. Bomb images, I use them. They're great. Also, um, what else I was going to say? Some more links. Another link I was using. Sublimation blanks. Um, somebody else. And check out my daughter. 
um, Facebook page. She does a lot of wood signs. So if you want to um, you want to purchase some wood signs from her, check her out. Hers is called um, Shay's Designs on Facebook. All right, I guess that's all the things I have to tell y'all about. So let's go ahead and show y'all these earrings, girl. I mean, I'm sorry, there's men on here also. Excuse me. So let me show you. I'm not gonna show you no addresses, but this is a nice package that she sent me. It's in this little black um um bubble wrap. And then her this is her design, one crafty chick. Okay, and she wrapped this stuff up so tight. I gotta get it open for y'all so I can show y'all. I love your stuff. I'm always buying your blanks. So hey Tuesday, where you been, girl? You ain't been on here in a while. Girl, no. <laughs> she got this stuff wrapped tight. Hey, do dream on. Hey, girl. Hey, girl. I'll always be shouting her out. Check out her video, Facebook, her YouTube channels. She has a lot of different channels. I mean, a lot of stuff on her channel. She be doing her thing. Okay, look at this. Girl, them would be too cute. I'm telling you, those are too cute. These are uh, sublimation blanks, okay? And she do remind you to take some the plastic off of them. Some of them do have plastic on it to, to cover up. And she tell you right here. And it's really, I'm glad she tell you because it's really, really thin. You really can't tell. But right here it says remove the plastic, okay? So uh, these are the bomb.com girl. <laughs> girl, <laughs> especially for our shoe lovers. Girl, you can sublimate this any color. You can make different kind of, you can make it, um, like a, uh, I'm kind of think what I'm thinking about. All kind of colors you can do. Girl, my mind is so blank. But um, different, just different colors you can do. African colors you could do. Sports colors you can do whatever you want with these earrings. What's it called? Not two tone, but splatter paint. You could do whatever you want on here. Like basically get to design, design it in um silhouette or whatever, and um make what you want, the colors you want. What's the words I'm talking about, y'all? Not not splatter paint, but the two tone and the, all that stuff, girl. These would be bad. What's the what's the news thing everybody doing with them shirts and stuff? Not ombre, but the um the different color. Like y'all gonna make me lose my mind up in here, up in here. Somebody tell me. You know I be thinking so hard. I be I can't even get the words out. Tie dye. Thank you, Shay. Thank you, Dimps. Tie dye. These would be cute. Girl, mm, mm, mm. get you a tie dye shirt and tie the tie dye these things. So she gave me a couple pairs. Am I missing one? Cause she gave me. I'm missing one. She's short. Oh no, I'm, I'm tripping. I got two pairs of these. Okay. And your tie dye coming back. So I think tie dye would be cute. But I made a lot of stuff. This I got a lot of earrings that she I got from her before. The Afro, she got Afro. I don't know if she sent me some Afros or not, but because I only asked for one thing, I asked her for some Nike ones, and she sent me all these. So shout out to one crafty chick. She, she, oh, she gave me some Afro ones. Some more Afro ones. I gotta make sure that I um don't forget to take this stuff off, this plastic off of it, because you will mess it up. All these have plastic, like little, you got to get your little crick, cricket knife and scratch that off. Little plastic ceiling on there. But look at these Afro girl. Mm, mm, mm. Cute. And last time she gave me the rings. So I'm going to see if she put the rings in there too. But if not, you can get the rings from Hobby Lobby. The one, the little earring hooks or whatever. Oh, I'm tripping. She got them right here. <laughs> Go ahead, girl. Go ahead. They right here. So she do supply the um, earring hooks. And they are cute. Let me show y'all the earring hooks real quick. I be getting so excited, y'all. Talking all fast and crazy. I'm looking back at my videos like, ooh, girl, you sound crazy, crazy. But here's a little thing. They're so easy to do. Just put them on here. Snap them on there. Y'all can see that. Cute, cute. Okay, so those come with it also. So here's the Afro, little Afros. Yes, girl, yes. Y'all better get hip. This is not my first order. She sent me some free stuff because I'm always purchasing from her. So she she cool. She cool people. Look, I don't know her, but she cool. She be inboxing me. She got a good... um. She um shipped this out. I asked her, call her like, well, I inboxed her on Etsy like a day ago. And then she shipped them out the next day. And I got them three-day mail. So, yeah, yeah. She's the bomb. And they sublimate so well. So, check her out. Check her out. Look at these, y'all. Look at these. Yeah, she has good service. She's very quick. 
Man, she just be helping the sister out. Cause, ooh, what is this? <laughs> like I said, I only asked her. I said, can you send me some of those Nike stuff? She's like, girl, I got you. And she sent me all this stuff. She sent me all this stuff. Y'all said, what's this? This is something new. And they, they so, I'm sorry. She got to wrap them. <sighs> this is something. Now I don't know. Um, do you have a machine? Do you cut these yourself? She's on here now. Lanise, do you cut these yourself or do you order them? I'm just, I'm just wondering. I mean, it don't matter if you do or not, but look, somebody got this machine to be cutting, cutting. What's that machine called? The cut machine. I want one so bad, but girl, I ain't spending no more money. I'm not doing it. But look at that. That's cute. That's, that's cute. This is not, these are new. She didn't have these before. These is cute. So I was wondering, did you cut them yourself? These are cute. Let me show you how this is. So basically you could put, hmm don't have no um hooks on them so maybe you can use these as earrings because they don't have no hooks on here the glow forge do you have a glow forge lanise but you can still you could probably get some regular hoops from um because the ones that she sent would not fit on here so you're probably going to get like something to go like because i can't figure out where the tips gonna go on these so you can do it like this and just get a bigger bigger some bigger hoops to put them around there to clip them on because they don't have a, they don't have holes in here there's no holes in these, so we'll figure it out. Oh, we're gonna figure out. Oh, she sold out already. Y'all done went into the shop and she sold out. Inboxer, because she had stuff that was sold out. Inboxer, let her know what you want. Okay. Lenise, are you still on here? And y'all, I'm sorry if I be talking fast. I be looking at my videos like I be talking out loud, thinking y'all can't hear me. These are cute too. These are so cute because you can design them the way you want to design them. That's the thing about them. You can design them the way you want to design them. Or oh, large adjusters. Okay. Now, this is what I asked for, y'all. Look at this. Look at these. I'm just dropping stuff. Look at this. I'll make sure they... I think I'm losing. I got 20-20. Lately, my eyes been crazy lately. Look at these. Yes. Oh, my God. This is what I wanted. So, she must be gone. She ain't answering me, so she must be gone. Hey, 40 Acres. Mm -hmm. Those would be so cute. I don't know which way. Just like that. Right there. Right there. Yes, yes. These are so cute. So I got a few pair of these. Shout out to, uh, like I said, her name is uh, her One Crafty Chick. And if it is sold out, inbox her. Because like I said, these Nike was, was she can't put, I mean, just inbox her. And, and ask her what she want, um, what you got, what she got. Okay. So I got Nikes, I got the Afros. Yes, girl. Yeah, she said, get the nice Nike shoes to match. Go ahead and get them colors and get them together. Get these. I got these. Sub in yourself so you can get some ideas for mine. Sub. I don't know what she said. Okay. So, um, that's all she sent me. This is, oh, girl, it's more. <laughs> it's more. And it's more. And it's more. I'm going to hurry to get this done so I don't have to be on this live all night. But let me see what she said. She just saying, here are some um, sublimation blank earrings. I hope you enjoy. Her Etsy shop is one crafty chick 910 Okay? one crafty chick 910 So she was on this live. So thank you, Denise. Thank you. I appreciate you, girl. Okay, so let me open some more. She got some more stuff in here for me. I love it. Oh, thank you, Dim. Dim, put it in there for y'all. Oh, shoot. You got it. Oh, what I got, y'all. He's like, ooh. 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 Ooh, these are cute. Oh, she be just coming up. I wonder if she cut these herself. Look at this. This is new, too. This is the Afro chick. And I have some Afro chicks like this, but it's different. Like, just the Afro puff in the, on the back of her head. So, she got all kind of stuff, y'all. All kind of Afro chicks, different kind of different kind of hair. Um, I'm gonna ask her. She got some dread ones. So, Lenisa, if you on here, let me know if you got some dread heads, cause I would get them, honey. I haven't seen them on her shop, but she'll probably make them if she if she can. Them is too cute. But I have some more. Like I said, I got some that I have. The, the Afro puff is back here on the back of her head. So it's so she got so many different kind. Okay, girl, this would be cute for like um Black History Month. And you can also do your um. Sublimation, your um teams and stuff. Anything. These are just basic with little um drops. These are cute. You can put names on them. You could put fraternities. Or, I mean, 
uh, like um, sororities and stuff on these. This is cute. Different ideas. You could put, um, you know, Zeta Phi Beta, whatever, they colors and stuff. These are the different ones, too. This is just plain ones. But you could put anything on here, too. Diva, put words on here, colors. Okay, these are just different shapes. And you got some footballs, y'all. Get your teams together. You can sell these. I'm telling you, you can sell these. Buy these and sell these because they will, um, them, them diehard football um, supporters, girl, get, get that money. And they, they, they hang nice. They like, I like dangly earrings. They're not dangly, but they hang. They're not too little. You could be, they could be, they could be, um, seen. So, yeah, she gave me a whole lot of stuff. Ooh, she, and they got the lipsticks. Is this a lipstick? Like a lipstick, yeah. Cute. She gave me a whole lot of stuff. Thank you. Lanisa, crafty chick. One crafty chick nine one zero on Etsy. Girl, I got another one to open. She just hooked me all the way up. Let me put some of these up. One more to open. Then we can go ahead and get these shirts sublimated. I already know what I'm sublimating. The yeah, lipsticks are cute. All of her items are nice. Yes, they are. She got other stuff too. She got different things to show you. She just don't want have earrings, but I want to do earrings, y'all. Oh my God, she just hooked me up. Look at this. I got some of these already, but now I got more diva. And it hangs like this. Cute, cute. A set of earrings. She gave me these. These are cute, cute, too. A set of these. She gave me a whole lot of them. It's not one set. She gave me like four sets each, y'all. She gave me some of these. It's Christmas coming. I, do, I, mean, it's, it's, I know it's a leaf, but she hooked me up. It's like, it's, I can tell it's been cut with the machine, the, uh, the glow forge. You can still smell it it's like if they would, but you sublimate them. It's not a, it's not a stinky smell, but you can tell it's been cut, freshly cut. Not a leaf. What is it? It is a leaf. What is it? Oh, I mean, a, <laughs> a cover. <Is> it a, <laughs> look, it looks like a leaf to me. What is this? Uh, uh, I'm about to say a four leaf clover, but that's not a four leaf clover. This is just a basic shape. No, I was laughing on high. Oh, okay. I'm thinking like, wait a minute. Am I saying, I know I'll be coming up with some great stuff, y'all. Um, so yeah, all these different things. I'm sure y'all more time what I have for y'all that came in late. I have 192 people watching. Can I get some thumbs up, please? Yes, it's fall time. So um Diva. I'm sorry if y'all couldn't see that. Diva. Some leaves or whatever this is, just different shapes and stuff. And she gave me sets and sets. I got like two or three sets each. They come with um earrings and they come with the little um earring hooks to put them on here. Okay. I'm gonna wrap these back up, put them back in the bag. But that's all I have. And I got these, these are cute. What other one at? I'm missing one. I think oh, I dropped it. Ugh. Okay, I got these these bad shoes. They are too cute. Make sure when y'all do them, make sure, because I remember I did one time, make sure you have the, the right ones. If you got something like those, because you don't want to have mismatch earrings. Have the afros. And she has so many different kind of afro heads. I'm going to see if she got some dreads, okay? I have this one. Okay, I have the Nike one. I have the football. Good for team sports. You know, your diehard fans, regular shapes. I'm going fast because I already showed y'all, so y'all can look at my video again if y'all want to look at it. This is thebomb.com. I'm going to show y'all another one that she made like these. Um, I got some in my drawer, but I'll show y'all later because I know y'all want to see me supplement these shirts, lipsticks, and then the hooks to go with them. A whole lot of hooks to go with them. So thank you, One Crafty Chick. She got me together. And why Dream On is on here, girl. Yeah, I'll be watching your videos. Let me show y'all. Um, She told us to get some of that um glow-in-the-dark Um. She told us about Heat Transfer Warehouse. Check her out. She got affiliate with um Heat Transfer Warehouse. Go to her page. Um, go to her Facebook page. She has an affiliate, so you can check. Go click on that and get this um vinyl. Heat trans. It's called Heat Transfer Warehouse. She told us. She told us about this. She be making stuff. Like, that shirt is cute, girl. So yeah, I'm gonna give you some vinyl. Um, this is the Sister Moonlight Blue. So she did some nice stuff. 
um, on some, oh, check out a video for some shirts she done did with this vinyl. It's so pretty. I'm going to do some soon. And then she also talked, and she had some other vinyl, girl. They were sold out. Couldn't get it. But she also told us about the Easy Glow in the dark. So I got some of that. I just got a little bit because I didn't know if I, if I was going to like it or not. But I know I am. But I just got a little bit to start off with. And then I got some, did I get two of the Easy Glow? Yeah, in the Easy Way Glow in the Dark. So I got two of those. Okay, so check um, the transfer, I mean, Heat Transfer Warehouse, okay? She is affiliated with them, so go to her page and click on that link. So, um, check out her shirt. She makes, she makes some bomb shirts. And I, because I don't really do a lot of vinyl, because I be double making so much, but when I get in the mood to do vinyl, I'm going to do these. Okay, I'll work with these. One more thing, I know I'll be... Some of the mission, but if y'all into sewing or if y'all into a lot of crafting, you gotta cut, girl. Go get check this out. Cordless electric scissors. Okay, I will put the link below. I got this from Amazon. Dog on it. I should have did that before I got on the video. But I think this video is over. I will put the link below so you can go exactly go to that right link to get this. Okay, so Amazon, Amazon, Amazon. It's called the Pink Ink Power Scissors. I'm, I'm gonna do a. Let me know if you want me to do a review on this. I do a lot of sewing and I hate using scissors. And anytime I use a dang on, uh, I'm about to say a roll cutter. <laughs> anytime I use the, uh, the these things right here, because I look at this. I'm a mess. Anytime I use these, I never, it always go dull on me. Like, dog, I just got it. Why is it dull? So I, I ain't using them right. So I said, let me go ahead and give me something that's going, I can plug in and cut for me. How about that? So that's what I did. So we're going to, uh, a rotary cover. Thank you. Um, a ready color. And every time I use one of them things, they don't ever work for me. So I got one of these. So we're going to do a review on this. Let me know if y'all want to see a review. Comment below. Review, please. And I will do one. I think that's all I got, y'all. I think that's all I got. So, and let me know if y'all want to do, um, if I know how to do bonnets. I've done bonnets before. But if y'all want to know how to do a shower cap, know how to sew up your own shower cap, let me know. I can do that too. So just comment below because I need to know what y'all want me to do. I write it down. I know the next couple of videos I'm gonna be doing is um some Canva videos that's coming up. Oh, my face look ashy. Um, Canva videos, and I also said I was gonna be doing some um sublimation mugs. I was gonna tell you the difference of how I was difference between sublimating in the air fryer versus the Cricut mug press. So you can see all the different things that you gotta do between those two things. So them two. Um, I do it to take a nap or maybe go to bed. Those two products, okay? So between the Easy Press, between the Cricut Mug Press and the Air Fryer. Girl, you are funny, making me laugh. I'll be talking crazy off the side of my face. I'll be getting tongue tied, talking fast, and then I forget what I want to say. Long bodies. So I haven't did a long bodies yet. Who in here can do Photoshop? I can't. So I ain't even gonna lie to you and tell you I can. And I was like, I'm, I even paid somebody to show me how to do it. And I still don't know how to do it. Photoshop is a beast, but Canva is the bomb. So um, quit laughing at me, y'all. <laughs> quit laughing at me. Um, I'm gonna do some videos on Canva, and also so Luet is a good um, a good software to use to to design, but <laughs> Photoshop. <laughs> Ain't my friend, and they don't want me to be great. So let's go ahead and get these shirts done. My son said um, he want me, he wanted some Halloween shirts. So I'm gonna get him some Halloween shirts, and then after I do that, I'm gonna do some um, mask. But I'm not gonna do the mask on the video because I just might not have enough time. But let me show y'all the images that I got for him on his shirts. So I already got everything. Oh, Infinity. I never heard. I mean, I heard of Infinity, but I don't have that either. So I'm gonna be doing that. I like silhouette and I like Canva. So I'm gonna do Canva and silhouette. So these are the ugly, scary things he wanted on the shirt because he just he's a boy. So I'm gonna give him what he wants because his mama can do that for him. So this is the one. Um, you can get these probably from um Etsy, okay? Just put in Halloween, put M Street, put Freddy Krueger, put Chucky, and you can probably get these from um Amazon. 
Did I say Amazon? I meant to say Etsy. Okay, so when my, my son is a, a youth large, so what I did was um I went ahead and sized this for it to be 8.5 by 9.3 for his shirt, okay? And this one right here is going to be 9.7 by 9. This is 11 by 17 paper, sublimation. So anybody know about sublimation, you have to have sublimation ink, sublimation printer, or you can just convert your printer over to a sublimation printer. I have the 11 by, I have the 7210 or a 7770, 70, dog, girl. You, I have the 7710 or the 7720, okay? Because some other images that I have um, that I'll be doing later, but I'm just going to do two shirts for him today. He just loves kind of all this crazy stuff. But, yeah, his mama can do it for him. I ain't got to pay for him at the store, so I'll give him what he wants. Oh, they're so ugly. But this is what boys like. He's 11, so he just like this. He loves Halloween. This boy, every day he wants to go to the Halloween store. Like, bro, we just went there yesterday. So everything is set up. I got everything done because I was trying to get, make sure I was good. So I didn't have to worry about doing all the kind of stuff. I just changed my ink. So my ink is full. So it shouldn't give me no problem. Um, like I said, it's 11 by 17 paper. I used um, Ink X Pro ink. And I use, um, today I'm going to be using Asa paper. But I use all kind of different paper, y'all. So check out my videos to see the other type of paper that I use for sublimation. So I go to File. And I go to print setup to make sure I have the same right paper in there because I've been doing a lot of stuff. So that, that's a 7710, but I'll be using, and I'm using the 11 by 17 paper. So let's go find that. And I go ahead and push that. And I go ahead and push OK. And I'm going to go ahead to push File. And I'm going to go ahead. And like I said, before I start, before I finish this video, with how I get these images on here, you go to Merge. So if you're new to Silhouette, you open Silhouette, you go to Merge. You don't go to the new you don't go to open you go to merge and when you click on merge that's when your um everything on your computer will pop up and you find your your image and then you put it here okay so that was one of the one of the things i went over today with my one-on-one so just wanted to just let y'all know that because it is kind of confusing when you look on here and you see all these words like what in word how do you get the image on here you go to merge and you merge your images in here and it's whatever's on your computer or your little flash drive you have in your computer that's what you can get your images from okay so then you go ahead and push print yeah, she said, um, there's videos on YouTube, girl. Like some people say, some things I cannot learn on YouTube, okay? And Photoshop is one. Because <laughs> believe me, I didn't watch every video on YouTube with Photoshop on it. So everything else I've te that I that I learned, I can I learn from YouTube. But Photoshop is not one. So I need a one-on-one. -on -one. And I'm thinking about just not even just forgetting about it. But Photoshop is very, very, a uh, very, very good. Um, so make sure, hold on. Make sure you go ahead and put flip horizontally. It's a very good software to use, but <laughs> your girl gonna stay with Canva and Silhouette until I got the time to figure out Silhouette. Because believe me, Silhouette, I mean, photo, I meant to say Photoshop. Photoshop is a really good design software. You could do so much with that. They even have college classes showing you how to do photo shoot. I'm gonna say photo shoot, right? right? Photo shoot, yeah. So let's go, I'm gonna go ahead and print this out. And then I'm gonna go ahead and press it on the shirt, y'all. I have a hundred. I have two hundred people watching right now. If you're new here, say newbie, virgin, and I'm gonna shout you out. Put down where you're living, where you where you stay, and I shout you out where you're living. And just excuse me, y'all, cause my my words be all over the place. So my stuff is printing out right there. You can see, is it coming out? Come on, baby, come, on, mama. Photoshop. I'm gonna say a photo shoot. <laughs> I told y'all, girl, don't listen. Don't listen to me all the time. I heard. My, I remember saying photo shoot. It's Photoshop. Hey, Deidre. She says Deidre with three E's. Hey, Angel from Detroit. Hey, Christian. Hey, girl. She ain't no new. It's not no newbie, girl. What you mean? Christian is um taking the one-on-one -on -one test with me, class with me, too. I thought you was on here before. This is your first time seeing me live, Christian? Okay. Oh, shoot, Charmaine. Um, duh, if I would have looked at that, I would have known that I did that wrong. Let's see. It should have printed. Okay, let me show y'all what I did wrong. So I told you I can goof up on y'all and y'all can see what I did wrong, but it should have worked. But let me show y'all what happened. See, this is the um, images I want to use. And this one right here came off the page. And let me show y'all really quick. It shouldn't did that, but it did. Because I didn't mess up this time. Okay, look. See right here? It when you put the box around there, it shouldn't, it should be okay. But see, it's not. 
<clears throat> see that box right there? I hate this line right here. Wherever this line is right here, y'all. I know y'all tired of me, but I be asking y'all how to get rid of this line. I don't know how to do it, but it's irritating. It's my soul. But see, this box is in the paper, and it shouldn't have cut it off, but it did. So, hmm. And I didn't mess up this time. That was not my fault. But see how it did that? It cut him off. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and just move him out the way. Oh, where's my dog on? Okay, move this out the way and put this in the middle. I'm sure I am trying to save paper and be cheap. Um, you got to do it over again. Use a whole sheet of paper. So there it is. What the heck? Why is that box on there? Oh, why is this box on here? Didn't did not um Jesus Christ? Why is this on here? Let me just see if I can delete. I don't know what this is. What this is? Why is this box on here? I don't know. But anywho, we're gonna just put this back here. I have the oh, do I have the wrong side? I have the wrong paper. I probably had the wrong paper. Let me see. Gotta go right here to the paper. That's why y'all got the wrong size paper in here. And I was just telling my class today, I said, make sure you had the right size paper in y'all stuff, okay? And look at me. So, yeah, to make sure your paper is matching your printer paper. So, it's 11 by, nine, 11 by 19. What is this? 11 by 17. Okay. So, let's go ahead and change it. Sorry if I'm moving around. I don't have my phone on the thingy. So, now it's 11 by 17. Now it's good. See, that's what the box was for. The box is telling me that my paper was not the, I mean, it was the paper size. So, I goofed up. So, it was my fault. <laughs> I messed up. So make sure when y'all um printing from silhouette, making sure that this says it by 17, which I just told my um my my client to well not clients, you know, the person that's been doing that I did a class with today. I was make, telling her to make sure the paper size was saying, look at me doing the wrong thing. So look, 11 by 17 matches through this right here. You go into file, print page setup, make sure it matches right here. Okay. And then make sure it matches on your printer right here, which will it will if that's so you go right here to um Paper, and then by 17, if you can see that. Well, that's bright. There it goes. Then by 17. So to make sure that match, and you would not make the mistake I just did. Okay? So it was my fault. <laughs> so I told y'all I goof up, so y'all can make, so y'all won't make the same mistakes I made. So I'm going to go ahead and print this out in a minute. So now what I do is, when I make these shirts, I basically tear my paper, because if you cut it, your, um, when you and you press it on your shirt, it will show you that crease like that line, that harsh line you get with the scissors, like this line right here. If you don't cut this, it's gonna show you that line on your, your shirt, and you don't want that. So let me turn it this way so I won't tear up anything. So you, you cut it so you can get that nice, that, so you won't get that harsh line. Okay, and don't tear your page. Okay, so that went away because I messed up. Like I always do on live, but I'm okay with that. So I'm not perfect, baby. I'm just cutting, tearing all around so I won't have that harsh line, okay? Because you don't want that in your shirt. And just, if you also, if you still get that line in your shirt, check your pressure on your heat press, okay? Make sure your, heat, your pressure is not that tight. You want a nice pressure, but you don't want it too tight when it's going to sc um, scorch your shirt or get lines in your shirt from the paper, okay? So, I'm just tearing away. I'm going to check y'all comments in a minute. So, if y'all got any questions, let me know and I can answer them. So, let me see. And yes, the picture does look dull because you it, it, the colors will pop after you press it on your shirt. So, there's Freddy Krueger. Let's see if y'all have any questions. Let's see, I haven't been asking no questions. Sorry about that, y'all. Uh, let's see. Can you tell me the good sublimation printer? 7710, 7720 Epson. Um, that's what I started. I do have a big baby over here too. That's the big one over there. That is the um S the Epson SC5 F70, and that prints up to 24 inches. Okay. I look at my, my stuff, my sticky notes on wall. Girl, I got sticky notes everywhere, all on my walls, everywhere, because I don't know. I'll be forgetting a lot of stuff. You know, my brain is working real hard. I'm looking for a good sublimation printer. Okay, I just told you what those were. Hello, hello, hello. Hey, hit the like button. Thank you. Hit the like button, please. Hey, let me see. Did you set the paper size? Yeah, thank you. I got it now. I think it turned off the point, the print border, and the box will go away. Oh, okay, that's the print border, too. So that's good. I kept it on there because last time I did a video and I printed out the print border. So that's why I got the print border on there. But the reason why that print border was showing me 
showing. I had the wrong paper size, and that's why it was so tiny. So that was my bad. But yeah, I'd like to keep the print border on there now because so I can know not to print mess up my images, my paper, like I just did. But that was because I had the wrong size. So let me go ahead and put this paper in here so I can print this last image out. If y'all know what ASAP looked like, it looked like this. <laughs> put the right way. This paper is very expensive. You can also use the regular print paper, printer paper, which is called. Somebody gonna tell you what it's called. I forgot what it's called. Um, I'm so sorry that I forget names a lot, but I have a lot of stuff to think about. <laughs> but all of the names and everything, everything that I use are under my videos. The links to them are in the videos. So check those out because I can't remember everything. I'm sorry. I can't remember everything, y'all. I just can't. Hammer meal. Thank you. So y'all, everybody, y'all my, my peeps, because y'all be helping the sister out, because y'all, my brain be overloaded. Okay, so let me go ahead and print this out real quick, and then I'm going to go ahead and go to the heat press, and we're ready to press this stuff together, and we're done. Press this stuff together. Press these images on the shirt. Okay, so that's about to print. Any questions? Hammer meal. Yeah, hammer meal paper is what you can use. It's very cheap. It's regular printer paper. You can get that from um, um, Office Depot, Office, Office Max, and it's way cheaper than uh, ASUB. And I do have a video on the difference between hammer meal, which is regular printer paper, and sublimation paper, okay? Hammer meal is not a sublimation paper. It's a regular printer paper, and it's cheaper. And I have a video on how it looks. You, as a designer, can tell that it's different, but if you're selling this, Stuff to somebody and be like, oh, is this, is this hammer meal paper? They ain't gonna know. But I know as a designer that it's not, but it still pops. But I like to use a sub because that's just me. But if you're starting off and you're doing samples, get you some cheap paper, some printer paper, and, and use that paper up until you um get good, get good, <laughs> until you are ready to sell your stuff professionally. How about that? And um, um, Hammer Meal does come in 11 by 17. I don't know if it comes in 13 by 19, but I know it comes in 11 by 17. So it does have large sheets, okay? Okay, he's ready. Chucky's ready. Let me go ahead and tear him up. Let's tear around him. He's, like, he's bigger. Um... So like I said, check out Halloween images on Etsy. Put in Chucky, put in Nightmare M Street, and it should pop up on Etsy for you. These are for my son. But if you want me to make some for you, for you, go ahead to my Etsy page. And if it's not on my link, um, I can put these on my. I can put these. No, I won't because these is like scary characters. And I have a I have a um a children boutique, but this is for like. It don't matter. But if you want me to do these shirts for you, if you don't see them, I, if you see anything that I do on my videos and you don't, if I'm doing anything on these videos and you don't see them on my, on my Etsy page, just go ahead and inbox me on Etsy and let me know what you want and I can do one for you, okay? But let's go ahead and go to the heat press and let's get it started. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm so corny, y'all. Uh. She said, what about a refurbished printer? I don't know. You got to see how it's, if it works. Get it together. If you get it together, you can do it, honey. But I don't know about refurbished. Like I said, just try it out if you want to. I'm trying to get y'all together here. Let's see. Okay. Okay. So now, put my pants up. <laughs> I got my sun shirt yesterday. I'm going to be using yesterday. It's like I said yesterday. Yes, today I'm going to be using a cricket shirt. And I love using cricket shirts for my son because they be really cheap. Somebody told me, somebody told me, I think Shawana Dimps. Somebody told me that they had cricket um, mugs on sale. Somebody told me that a few minutes uh, yesterday. So check out cricket. They do have their mugs on sale, but I do not know if they had their shirts on sale right now. So let me know because I'm a I have to go get some more shirts because I'm out of my large shirts. I use the Cricut shirts. I I do use Cricut shirts for kids, okay? But I use Cricut shirts for my adults to sell because I like to use jersey. And I like to, and it's from um, 
jiffyshirts.com. Okay, so I use that, but Cricut shirts, I do use them to sell for my kids, but I'm not saying nothing wrong with Cricut, but it's just a big old tag that says Cricut on the neck, and I don't want to have no adult. Like, oh, I got a Cricut shirt on. Nothing wrong with it, but that's just my preference. I use kids shirts. They are very good material, very thick, very sublimatable. <laughs> Sublimates well. Thick, nice material, but like I said, oh, it don't have Cricut on there. My bad. I don't know what I'm thinking. It don't have cricket on there. It just has large. But to me, I just like the way the jersey shirts look from um any kind of jersey shirt. I get them any kind of anywhere, but I get from JiffyShirts.com. But I also love, love, love the way that um the shirts from Condi.com. I forgot to tell you. Condi.com. I don't know why that link wasn't on my list. But Condi.com, ask for Chloe, and she'll get you a discount on whatever you purchase from Condi. Condi.com or Die Trans, okay? So ask for Chloe Smith. Call the 1-800 number on their website. Don't order online. Go to their website. Call the 1-800 number. Ask for Chloe Smith. Tell them that Charmaine Galloway sent you and they will give you a discount and stuff. I love, love, love their shirts. Right now, I can't think of the name of them or the shirts they have, but they're the bomb. They are a little bit more expensive, but oh my gosh. They are so, the, 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 the material is so nice and thick and it still makes well and they have big sizes. Like I get my four, I'm about to say four T's, four X and five X's from Condi. They are a little bit more expensive, but you get what you pay for, right? So, but the jerseys are, shirts are cute, are good too, but Condi shirts are thicker than jerseys, okay? Condi shirts are thicker and it's, oh, they call it Viper. Viper shirts from Condi. They're the bomb.com. I love them. Okay, so let me stop talking. But I'll be trying to talk to y'all because some of y'all don't be on my videos and y'all don't be knowing. So I'll be trying to tell y'all everything I know on every video because y'all might not be watching all my videos. So y'all might miss something. So that's why I'll be talking so much. Some people say I talk too much. Everybody say I talk too fast. No, just <laughs> but I try to tell y'all what I know because sometimes you don't watch all my videos. So I tell y'all mostly the same thing on all the videos because you might not watch every one of them. So I'm putting some paper under it. Which is just some regular paper. I'll put it under here. But you can also get a roll of paper from Sam's. I got links below let you know where you can get these the, the roll of paper so you don't have to worry about buying sheets of paper. You get it on a roll and just cut it or tear it, okay? But I just got this small size because this is a little t-shirt for kids. So I'm just going to put it on here. So y'all going to want to look at me, do y'all? Let me put y'all on the shirt. Oh, shoot. Look at my naked mannequin. Okay. So here's the shirt. And what I'm doing now, don't look, look at my, my oven over there. This is all crafting. I know I don't be cooking food down here. That's for my tumblers. So I go down the neckline, take the neckline right here, and I go down. For the kids, you go down um, three inches from the neckline. Get my little dandy ruler, tape measure, and you bring it down. I mean, you... um. I already um um heated girl. I already um he pressed the shirt to get the wrinkles and the moisture out, okay? I already did and I also lint rolled it with a lint roller. Okay. So that's done. So now I'm gonna go ahead three inches down from the neck. Is that for no my, for this is for youth? So it's uh two inches. I'm sorry, two inches for the youth. So right here, and I'm gonna go ahead and put the paper right here. And the reason why you put the um Paper in between the shirt because you do not want that ink to bleed through the, the back of the shirt, okay? I'm going to ask y'all questions in a minute, but I see Dimps asking some questions, so thanks, girl. I'm going to ask, but I can't look right now because I'm trying to get this shirt out here because it's hot under this heat press. So how I do it, so somebody was telling me, like I said, I'm doing a one-on-one -on -one with someone. She was telling me that she used the templates on Cricut. Let me see. She used the templates on Cricut or whatever to do her, um, like, cups and mugs or whatever, I never, ever used a template before in my life. I, what I do is measure everything, okay? So if I want to know what size I need to put this image on a cup, I measure the cup, and I measure how I, I need to do that, okay? And that's the same thing for the shirt. I basically just, go, um, the shirt, I do go, I have a heat transfer vinyl sizing and placement chart, and it's com it comes from iCraft Vinyl, so check them out. The chart that they have, I cannot send it to y'all, but it is a chart called Heat transfer vinyl sizing and replace and placement chart. You can go ahead and Google that and it should come up, but it's from iCraft vinyl and it's right here in my mess. Like I tell you, let me show y'all real quick what I'm going through over here. See, I have it right here for me. So whenever I'm about to do something, it's right there. Okay, so that's what it's called. Heat transfer vinyl sizing. And I also do this with, with all my images that I put on shirts and stuff. And look at this, y'all. These are my sticky notes of everything I know, so I can know what time and temp I use. So this is how I do my thing, okay? <laughs> 
because I don't have to look in no book. It's right in my face. Bam. It's supposed to be my little logo, but my logo was covered up with all the little stick notes. Okay, so that needs to go over some. And basically, you just basically, you measure from the outs, the um, outer side of the image. So this is the, the end of the image right here. So I measure from that part to the end of the shirt. So that's like three and a half. I take that, make sure that's three and a half on this side too, from the outer, go from the outer to the image, outer image to the end of the shirt. It's about right there, right there. And y'all, I'll be so scared when I do this because I'm always, my eyes is kind of crooked to me because sometimes the stuff don't be centered. This, and I also have center. I have these things to center stuff with, y'all. But let me check to see if I can, if it's going to be a difference in here. This is a youth one. I got these from Amazon also. It's plastic. But, oh, I did good. You put it right down by the neckline. And the air, the center is right here. Which is good. I did good, y'all. Go get these off of Amazon. They call it a t-shirt. Center, center. Then I put the tape. I got the little heat trust transfer tape. Heat tape. I go ahead and tape that. Cover it up. And now go ahead and heat it. 400 degrees for 60 seconds. Make sure your pressure is good. Ooh, that's kind of tight, y'all. Any questions why I sit and watch? It's hot, y'all. I was, it was a bundle. They're so quick. What, what bundle? Um... Heat press the machine. Okay, okay, the heat press. Okay, HSN. They had the mug. See, I know you said you was going to get you. You was getting one. Them. Did you get it? Did you get the heat press? The cricket mug press? I keep on saying heat press. Did you get that, Dimps? Let's see. What kind of heat press is this? Thank you. Girl, Dimps know all my... She know my whole life, okay? Yes, Dimps said I have a 16 by 24 heat press, and she is correct. <laughs> but I also have a 15 by 15. I bought that one first. But as you can see, this thing is tiny, and I'm doing a lot of work now. And plus, this thing, burn my knuckles. I, this is I use it as a stand now. Everything is on here. But I still use it for my, my embroidery. And I used to hit my knuckles like this. And then I used to, girl, walk walking around with these black knuckles. Now I like this one because... I just basically up and pull it on now. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> See what I'm saying? You need to cover it up because look at that images on that paper. Okay. We're going to throw it away. And we're going to see what we got. Y'all want to see? Cricket is the bomb. I mean, anything. I mean, shirts, whatever shirts is the bomb. But let's see how this looks. Y'all ready? Let me see some thumbs up. I got 248 people watching. Let me see some thumbs up on this video if y'all want to see how this looks on this image. How this image come out on the shirt. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. 170. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. Yeah, I'm irritating y'all. Thumbs up on your on the like this video. Ready? Oh, this is hot. 174. Oh, this is hot, y'all. I can't show y'all. No, I'm just playing. 179. Jesus is hot. <laughs> Y'all know I'm procrastinating. Let me see some more likes, y'all. I got 230 people watching. Only 170, 1979 likes. Y'all don't like me today. You got to go out the video and like the video. Oh, shoot. <laughs> oh, my gosh. My daughter used to go out and buy shirts for her and her grandson. Okay, let's see. Can I get some likes? Just because I gave it to y'all without getting my full likes. Look at that. Look at Freddie. That color is popping. Popping. Cricket shirt, y'all. Cricket shirt. Yes. And I love this image because you know what? A lot of people... And I mean, this is Photoshop. Photoshop would do this for you. A lot of people had these box images and stuff, and I love. That's why I like these images. These images. That's why I act. That's why I got them. Well, somebody gave them to me, but I don't know where she got them from. Sorry, but I just asked from. I didn't ask them to give them to me for free, but she did. Um, anywho, um, I like these because they're not boxed. Okay, they're not box images, and they didn't bleed through, so I can keep. I can save this. It's um, it's got a nice outline to it you know what i'm saying so it's nice you don't got to worry about walking around here with it. even though i'm not saying nothing wrong with oh that's too low sherman why did i do it so low what was i doing i said two inches that's not no two inches 
Girl, see, I'm talking to y'all. I be jacking up. Girl, that's not two inches. Below the neckline. That's like three inches. So, yeah, I must have been talking and went down too far. But it's for my son. So, that is too low. But he's going to wear it because I'm going to make him. No, I ain't going to make him wear it because he's going to wear it because he want to wear it. But it's too low. As you can see, that is too low for the um for the shirt. So, it'll be up a little bit, little bit higher. But the next one, I'll do it right. Okay. So, y'all be talking to y'all. That's why I be trying to do orders with y'all because I be talking and... His heat press is hot. Any questions, y'all? Any questions? I got 199 likes. And I have 262 people watching. To like this video, you just basically go out the video and you um click on like to the video. I appreciate it. Because when you would like more likes I get, the more people will watch, come back and watch the video. And I love teaching people. So... They can come back and see what we did today. I'm going to go ahead and um, press, uh, heat press, press this moisture out of this shirt. Get the image in. We're going to be done with this video, y'all. Where's my lint, my lint roller? I don't know what I did with my lint roller, y'all. So I'm going to be lint rolling this. It's for my son. He'll be all right. And let me go ahead and heat press this out after I get this paper. I always press it with the paper on top of it just because it might be something on my heat press and I want it to be on this white shirt. Sorry that my camera is shaking. So just go ahead and press it a little bit. Sorry, y'all. This table is kind of wobbly. And I'm going to go ahead and put my image on here. We're going to be doing Chucky. And I'm going to go ahead and go down two. This time I'm going to do it right. Two inches. It's supposed to be way up here. And then I'm going to go ahead and Straighten it out. And let's see how Chucky going to look. Three over here. Three over here. Like I told y'all how I, how I basically make my sure my center. You can use the little center chart. You can use the center, um, the little plastic things you get from Amazon. This is how I do it. Sometimes that's um, three and a half. Three and a half. Perfect. Get my tape. Heat tape. No, not regular tape. It's heat tape. Tape your image on here so it won't move. Get your protective paper. Place it on there. And heat it on up for 400 to 60 seconds. And that's all she wrote. Okay, let's see what y'all saying. Exit out the... Thank you, thank you for showing because now I got 216 likes. Thank you. I know it's hard. People always say how you do it. Yeah, it's just crazy. I guess I never, yeah, you got to go out the video, like it, and come back. So that mean that you like what I'm doing. You like what I see that I could do more. She said, anyone know where y'all can find the, the um shirts? I get them from jerk. Uh, these are cricket shirts I'm using. These are cricket shirts. So go to cricket.com and let me know if they got a sale because if they got a sale, I'm going there today and get some more because they sell their shirts be kind of cheap and they're really good shirts. But I get mine from jiffy.com also. Jiffyshirts.com. I also get it from Condi. If you go to condi.com or it's called Condi or Die Trans, ask for Chloe Smith and um say Charmaine Galloway sent you and she will hook you up. They love me at Condi. They give me all kind of stuff. Okay, let's see what they got here. Oh, girl, that thing be putting my head, put my back into it. Okay, y'all want to see Chucky? Y'all want to see? Let's see some more likes. Oh, y'all up there almost. I got 222 likes. Thanks for, thank y'all for the likes. Oh, y'all want to look at me or y'all want to see the shirt? No, let me see. They do have sales on cricket items right now. I know that the mugs are on sale right now, but I don't know about the shirts. So let's see what we got here. I'd be so excited. Every time I do something, self nation is the bomb. Oh, why that's why y'all looking at that? Look at these. The cups I made. These are sublimation cups that I made. I mean that I sublimated. Um, y'all. I'll tell you the name. We got these the bomb. I never sublimated on anything but white cups, white mugs. And look at these. I did these on my last video. If you want to know how I did these, check out my last video. Ooh, don't want to crack nothing. Look at these beautiful. These colors are amazing. Amazing. So I'm going to be telling y'all in a minute who I got, where I got these cups from. After I show y'all my shirt. Ain't those cups cute? Okay, 
Okay, y'all ready? You ready to see Chucky? Oh my God, Becky, look at that picture. Look at his face. He looks scary as heck. My son like this kind of stuff. You know, my mom, it's a new Chucky movie coming out. Boy, I mean, I like Chucky. Chucky cool. I'll watch that movie with him. But some of his other stuff, I would not be watching. But I, I like Chucky. When I was little, I used to love watching Chucky. But and then the more he made, the stupider it got. <laughs> but the first Chucky, I'll watch that again. But look at that. Ain't that nice? Ain't that pretty? That's a good size. That's a good... Um, I did that one correctly. Let me show y'all how it looks. I'm hot, y'all. I'm hot. Look at my shirt. I made this a long time ago, but... If I dreamt it, I worked hard, I grind till I own it. Okay. I dream. I'm just a dream. I dream. Look at that shirt. Ooh, this shirt hot. He's like, he gonna just get you. Get him, chick. Get him. No, that's the first message. Last shirt I did. First shirt I did was this one. Freddie and Chucky for my son. My dad want me to make him some. I might do this heat press on because he want me to make him some. Um, he want me to make him some Raven. I think it's Baltimore Ravens. He been begging me for them shirts. I ain't did them yet. So now I found some images on Etsy. So I'm gonna make them today. Let me go back here and see if I got any five X. He need a five X, y'all. So let me see if I got a five X. I can make his shirt later. Um, no, I mean I don't got no five X. Do I? I got three X's. I think he said he needed a 4X. I got to order some more. So maybe he won't be getting a shirt today. Nope. So he going to have to wait until I order some more shirts. But yeah. That's what I'm going to do for him. And I'm going to make some face. I'm going to make some masks. Let me show you how the mask is going to look. I got my craft room. I've been just tripping over everything. Okay, this is what I'm doing to be doing. They wanted this. We, getting, we got these shirts made, right? So what I'm going to be doing is making some masks with this on it. So we're going to have the matching shirts, and we're going to be doing, I'm going to be using that. Why is that yellow part in there? Really? I just not notice. Oh, that goes on that. Did that go on there like that? Oh, well. I just not noticed this little image right here, this little thing right there. They don't like it supposed to be there. Wow. Okay, anyway, yes, I have to um do some... Mask with this on there. I have like 12 masks to do. And I, what I do. I left my dog on. Well, any questions, y'all? I'm gonna get out of, of this live because I gotta figure out. <sighs> so check out my Essie page, Charming Girl Boutique. Number two, check out my um children Etsy page, Array of Sunshine Boutique. If you want to have any one, I have I also do one-on-one -on -one classes by Zoom or FaceTime or uh, Facebook Messenger. I do beginning cricket. Embroidery, sewing, silhouette, Canva, embroidery, sewing, sublimation videos. Okay, or you can come, you can meet me here in, if you're in Ohio, Toledo, come meet me. We do one on one here in my spots. Oh, y'all, but for everybody, what's going on? Can y'all hear me now? So, um, I'm about to get out this video and do some mask, but I was going to do the mask. I was going to show you how to do the mask, but I can't because it's got a little, a little something on, my, on the shirt that's not supposed to be there. So I'm going to take, send this back. Somebody sent me this picture. I'm going to go ahead and send this picture back to him and let him know, look, this I'm going to use this picture. So I use, do that on this live today. So, um, next time I come on, I can be doing, I will be doing like the, the mugs sublimated in the mug press versus the air fryer okay and i'm also do some canva videos all right any other questions y'all this video will be up so if you miss any of this video you can go back to the beginning of this video and watch it over
Okay, no more questions. I'm going to give you a couple more minutes to ask questions. If no more questions, I'm going to get out of here. Yes, I have done a video on air fryer. Yes. Go check out my um video. It's called Sublimation, Sublimating a Mug in the Air Fryer. And if you want to see some, I also have one called Sublimation, Sublimating a Tumbler in the in the convection oven. And I also have one called Sublimation Sublimating a Mug in a Cricket Mug Press. So I have them all. And also I have one called Sublimating a Tumbler in the Tumbler Press. So you can check those out, but I'm going to do one that's going to be one that has the Cricut mug press versus the the um air fryer. And basically, it's going to tell you what you need versus what you don't need for the other item, product. Okay. You ever overheated a shirt? Yes, I messed up a lot of stuff. I done messed up a lot of mugs, tumblers, shirts, a lot of stuff, y'all. And overheating me, I mean, you basically just either got your pressure too tight, too um, too tight, or your um heat your your um heat, um heat press is too high. Like for me, I can't do four hundred. I have to do like let me see three ninety something, three ninety five or something like that. I can't do through four hundred because I will scorch a shirt. So mine's it's a, I have a nice. Heat press from Heat Press Nation, 16 by 24, and it gets hot. So, and I only had it about a year, so I had to go down. So, you could check it out. Just check how your, how your stuff goes. You basically just try it out. If it gets too hot, you know, try to redo some things, readjust some things to make it work for you. You ain't going to get everything perfect. You're going to mess up some stuff unless you're just that good. You say yes to the Ravens. You know, my, my, daughter, my dad liked the Ravens, so I got some images that I found. So, I'm going to do him a shirt. But I got to order some more shirts. I'm going to do that today. I'm going to go ahead and write this down because I will forget. Order some 4X's. Order 4X shirts. And what else I said I was going to do? Oh, Cricut shirts. Large. I'm sorry. I'm putting my little to-do list on here because I will forget because my brain is over full. Cricut large kids. Okay, let me see the image for the Ravens. I will show you. Let me go ahead and let me upload it to um Silhouette first real quick. I have two different images. I'm going to do two shirts for him. And I just found them on Etsy today. There is one. I'm just go ahead and put them on, what's the name? On Silhouette, and then I'll show you in a minute, okay? It took me a long time to find it, because I was thinking, I was trying to find some SVGs. And I'm like, man, I ain't about to put this on no vinyl because it's too much. It's too many colors. So I'm like, I'm just going to hit put it on um on a sublimation. I'm going to go ahead and sublimate them. And that's what I'm going to do, honey. Let me show you all these two images real quick. This is one. See all that stuff? That's going to be all that with the vinyl. I could do this with vinyl too, but I'm just lazy, y'all. I love sublimation. And that was pretty cool. I just seen these two. And that's what I'm going to do. Get him two shirts with these two images on it. And that's how we're going to do it. He's been asking me for it. But I was trying, like I said, I was trying to do him a vinyl shirt, but I couldn't find them. So I'm like, sure, man, go ahead and sublimate that man a shirt. Sublimation is so easy. It's so much, it's so easy. It's not work to do at all. Just get your stuff, print it out, size your image, print it out, heat it up. Bad out, it's done. Anything else y'all want to talk about before we get out of here? Where can I get the Viper shirts? The Viper shirts, Vapor shirts. They call it Vapor. The Vapor or Viper? From um Condi.com. I love them. The material is the bomb. They are, I'm not going to say they're a little bit more expensive than the one from uh, Jiffy shirts, but sometimes the Jiffy shirts be sold out. So I can go right to Condi. Condi be having their stuff on, on lock. So I might end up getting my, get, no, nah, my daddy. He don't gotta get a look. He don't gotta get a, a viper shirt. Viper shirt. I can get him one from Jiffy because they're cheaper. <laughs> but they still. It don't matter. They still have. They still both good quality shirts. Oh, let me show you something real quick. I'm looking at the stuff that I just got today. I just ordered these today from um from what is it called J Sublim Sublimation J's from journals. So I can sublimate them on sublimate on these journals, y'all. 
This is a small one. I didn't know. I looked at the. I just said, let me get both of them to see what size difference they are. But I'm going to order them where these. these are too small. But these are really tiny journals. Okay. These are cute. This is too small. I'm going to order them where these. I just want to see the size. But basically, you take this off and you sublimate the, the, uh, both sides like this on sublimation. So you sublimate this one. I got two of these single J's. Okay. And then I got this one. This is the one I like. And like I said, people. I also have videos on how to do journals, make your own journals with the cinch, with um, printing with through Canva. So I design journals, I design calendars, planners, all through Canva. So check out those videos on my page. If you want to design those, that's fine. You make your own lines, you make you, you bind it, all that. I'll show you how to do all that because everybody's making these journals now. It's a really good business to make journals, right? But this one, you basically just buy these and sublimate these. And you have a nice little um, design. Sublimation. Um, this one is different because, well, I, when I show you how to do the journal in ca Canva, and I print it out with a regular inkjet printer, I use cardstock. You can, I mean, I'm sorry. You can use um, sticker paper, and you put the sticker paper on cardstock, or what is that stuff? Not cardstock, but it's it's thick and it's brown. You can get it in white too. Not car stock, but tell me what it is, y'all. I, I suck at delivering messages, information y'all need to know, because my... Not car stock. What is it called? It's right It's right here. What is this called? See, this is the same thing, but they, they basically um put this car chipboard. This is chipboard. So what I use is chipboard. I get my chipboard from Office Depot, and then basically I use the chipboard... Or you can get it from Amazon, and then you just basically get sticker paper and put your image on sticker paper, and you could put it on your um, your journal when you're making it with the cinch, okay? No, you're not sublimating when you're making it with a cinch because you can just print it out with a regular printer, so you don't have to have a sublimation printer to make a binder. People are saying, I got to have a sublimation printer, sublimation ink to make a journal. No, you don't. You can use regular ink, regular printer, and print it out on 8.5 by 11 paper or whatever paper you want to use it, or you can cut it to make it however size you want it. Then you use the cinch to, you know, to bind it, which is how you bind it right here to make it a, um, a journal or a calendar or a planner. I have all the videos on how to do those three things in my on my site, and I use Canva.com. Okay, but this one right here is already um it's already done for you. Only thing you got to do is sublimate this, and then you just basically glue. It's like some tape. It, it, it comes with like the little glue, and you put it right in here, and then you glue it closed so it can stay. Okay. So yeah, it's card. It's, it's called um chipboard. See, and it's really and it's really sturdy, so you can make your own journals. Or if you don't want to make, do all go through all that and making them and um, and um binding them, you just basically buy some and you can just go ahead and sublimate them. Okay. I need a stick. I never used it before, so I know it's got to be a way you got to you can stick this on here, but it's not even. I had to call single J's and see how this sticks on here. Alrighty. Any questions? These are cute because I'm saying you can you can make any designs you want with your regular printer too. But this is um easy. It's easier. You don't gotta worry about going through all that. You can just go ahead and use um sublimate it and it's, it's it'll be quicker to do something like this. Let me show y'all how to paper the lines look in this one. But when you use the Canva and you do your own, you can customize your journal you like it right for me i put lines on mine and then also put images behind here you know how you could see like a, a, a female or anybody you can put images behind like and then you can make it you can um make it a little lighter so you can be able to write on top of the lady so i can design you can do so much designing in canva instead of just having plain pages you can make you can decorate your pages in canva.com um i got these from um j uh sublimation j sublimation Single J's. Single J's dot com. Is, these are nice. I got two of these and I got the two small ones. Ooh. 
what she say? Smug mama's creation. Shug's mama's creation. Hey, Charmaine, just get in. When you was on the clipboard, what? When you was on the chipboard, but what did you, oh, you missed a whole lot, girlfriend. We just supplemented two shirts with, um, cricket t-shirts. And what, I showed y'all some earrings that I got from, um, Crafty Chick. One Crafty Chick, 910 on Etsy. So you missed a whole video, but it's okay. This video will still be up. You can go back and watch it. So go ahead and subscribe to this channel so y'all can be um, notified when I do lives and videos. And a lot more to come. Check out my Instagram, Miss Charming Gal. Check out my um. I'm sorry, I'm to put these back in here. Check out my um. What's it called? Oh my TikTok girl. Everybody on TikTok girl. I be doing them TikTok. I'm so I know I say girl even though I'm talking to everybody. I'm sorry. TikTok is the bomb, y'all. Check out my TikTok, and I show y'all um, videos of how I do a lot of different things that I do in the real smart videos, but it's really helpful if you're doing certain things. Go ahead and subscribe to me on TikTok. I'm trying to get them views up. TikTok is the bomb. To end. And go ahead and subscribe and like my, um, Etsy, my Instagram page. Please, 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 and thank you. Thank you. Miss um Dems just put it in the um in the comments. My my um it's talk or I'm talking to go to bed because I'm over. I'm just doing too much talking over my words. Okay, y'all. My throat is kind of hurting. I'm getting sick. I hope I don't get sick. I can't get sick, y'all. Y'all know I have a daycare center, and them kids just be snotting all over the place. But we disinfect every day. But girl, I can feel it coming in. <sighs> True. Any other questions so I can get out of here? It is 9.15 where I'm at. And I need to get myself together. I'm going to do some of these masks tonight, I guess. Oh, remove the backing paper. That's what it is? Because I, I need to check real quick because I'm kind of lost. It didn't seem like there was no paper on the back of it, but we're going to see. <laughs> you are right. That's, yep, that's right. Thank you. Yeah, so basically, to make it sticky, just remove the brown paper. It was seemed like it was so good tight on there. I'm thinking I was going to mess up something. So, yep, basically, it's a thin piece of paper. I thought this was chipboard, which it, what it is. I thought I was going to tear it up. So, yep, you can basically move this paper off, and it's sticky. So, thank y'all. That's how we going to do it. And I thought it just didn't seem like it was going to, it was no kind of lift. So I was like, man, if I lift it, it's going to tear. So it wasn't no kind of, it's no one really telling me that I can lift this. So now I know it's on there real good. So yeah, that's how you do it. So I'm going to do these. I'm gonna, and let me know if you want to see a video on me doing these. So I just basically a design. I measure this. I'm going to measure it and then um design it in silhouette. That'd be some cute. A little. I love journals, y'all. I love notebooks. I, I just love writing. If I don't write it down, I will forget. She said yes, yes, yes. Videos on a journal. Okay. So thanks, y'all. I got some. I'm gonna write it down so I can have some videos. Y'all got some videos coming up, y'all. Y'all gonna be seeing me a lot. I got some stuff. Like I said, I'll be off here because I'll be know what y'all wanna see. So I'm gonna go ahead and sub put sublimation journals on here. We're gonna do that. We got the um sublimation mugs versus. The mud press versus the uh, air fryer. We got Canva tutorials coming up. Um, and shower cap. I'm gonna put that on there too. Learn how to make your own shower caps. Put that on here. So y'all gonna be seeing my face a lot. At the, this is my last video. No, let me see. This is only Wednesday. So um, today is the 13th. Oh no, I'm tripping. Today is the 6th. Um, I'm going out of town next week to Jamaica, baby. So I might have another video probably on before before Thursday. So I'll come back on here and do something else. I might come back and do these masks. Y'all want to see me do some of these masks? That'd be something different. Because people, you still have to wear masks when you're going on an airplane and when you're going out of town. And some places you have to put them on if you ain't vaccinated. So 
I can do some stuff. Even though I have a video on how to sublimate masks, I can do some more. Because um, y'all like seeing new videos, don't y'all? So I'm going to go ahead and do some videos. I might come back on either tomorrow or Saturday to do these. Not tomorrow, because I need a day off. So I might come back on, on Saturday to do these masks. I think I got a one-on-one -on -one class to do on Saturday morning or Saturday night. And I just do it on Saturday, y'all. So look out for me on Saturday or Sunday, okay? Because you know when I say Saturday, I won't come. So I'm either Saturday or Sunday, and I will put it in the group, give y'all 30-minute notice that I'll be coming back and we're going to do some masks because I need to have these masks done by Monday. So, yes, I do a couple of them, and I do them, and then I come back on live and do Because I got like, like, I got like 12 of them to do. We all going on the um uh, Jamaica trip. So I do a couple of them. Either Friday, Saturday, Friday. I was supposed to do them today, y'all. My calendar says do mask. And I did some, my shirts for my son. See how I procrastinate? Especially when it comes to orders. But they're fine because we're not going. <laughs> look, they're fine. We're not going to Jamaica until Thursday. But I'm going to have them to them by my Monday. So, And I deliver them to them because they're all here in Toledo. I mean, in my state. So, with that being said, but some people on the reviews hasn't received theirs yet. What are you talking about, Maddie? I believe I'm at MC. Be safe and have fun. Thank you. Thank you. Where you get your stand to hold your printer. These This came from Target. Okay. This thing, I got a lot of them, girl. I got a lot of them. They're very sturdy. They have one, two, three, four, five shelves. It's black. I love black. So, I got like five of these shelves. And they weren't that expensive. They get them. I got them from Target. Okay. I need to clean that up. Just some. Ooh, y'all looking at uh, I need to be down here like this. But yeah, this is my paper up here, y'all. I need to have a nice background, but you'll see I work. I work. So y'all have to see the background coming here when you're on my channel. And see my my machines. Okay. Um, let me see. Enjoy your stuff. Be careful. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, y'all see y'all before I go on that trip. So um I'll be doing a video probably like I said, Saturday, Sunday. So look out. If you subscribe to my channel, you'll be notified. Go ahead and subscribe to this channel. Yeah, I'm going to get some hot lemon juice. Because my throat... You talking about me, Maddie? Because my throat is bothering. But I usually drink sweet tea. And I'll be good. And I need to get something. Because me talking ain't working crazy. Because every time I get a sore throat, I, drink, I go to McDonald's to get a sweet tea. And, it, and then the pain, the, the pain is gone. She's like, something wrong with you. <laughs> but I'm serious. <laughs> I always get a sweet tea from McDonald's. And the next thing you know, I... Whatever. But I'm glad it's... I don't like taking medicine. But I have, will if I have to. But... Yeah, I'm gonna drink some hot tea. Then hot tea will keep me up all night. But like green tea shouldn't be that it should be okay. So okay, I'm gonna give you some green tea like y'all tell like y'all told me to. And I'm going to figure out this image for this uh shirt. And I I mean for these masks, and I'll start some tonight probably, and I'm gonna save some for y'all to do video because I need to get started on. I don't have anything else to do tonight, so I'm gonna go get these masks started because you know how I like to procrastinate. So I'm gonna get these masks started. I'm gonna save some to do on a live with y'all on either Saturday or Sunday because I got 12 of them to do it. I'm not gonna do them all tonight. So I'll probably do six tonight and then six on the other day or Sunday. So until next time, be blessed. Bye.